How to integrate external user databases to manage system user accounts. Prerequisites. An AD or LDAP server has been installed and correctly configured. The AD or LDAP server can communicate with iMaster NCE campus. You have obtained the information about the AD or LDAP server from the AD or LDAP server provider. You have obtained the AD or LDAP server information by using AD Explorer. Configuration Procedure Create a user group on iMaster NCE Campus. Configure remote authentication. Log in to iMaster NCE Campus as an AD or LDAP user. Function Description User authentication modes include local authentication and remote authentication. If remote authentication is enabled, the local system can interconnect with a third-party system to implement AAA. After the interconnection is complete, users are remotely authenticated by the third-party system instead of the local system. In remote authentication, users are authenticated by a remote AAA server through AAA protocols. Currently, the ONM plane supports LDAP and RADIUS for AAA authentication. LDAP is a lightweight directory access protocol. It supports multiple authentication modes. The system authenticates users based on their usernames and passwords, or in TLS mode. Users can configure login information on an LDAP server, and user authentication is performed by the LDAP server during the login. Application Scenarios Login information is saved on an AD or LDAP server. It is required that iMaster NCE Campus interconnect with the AD or LDAP server. After the interconnection is successful, users are remotely authenticated by the AD or LDAP server during login. Procedure Step 1 Create a user group on iMaster NCE Campus. 1. Log in to iMaster NCE Campus as the System Administrator and choose System, User Management, User Management from the main menu. On the User Group tab page, click Create and create the user group based on the user information. 2. The following describes how to create the Administrator's User Group. Set User Group Name to Administrators and click Next. 3. Select Roles and click Next. 4. Select the objects to be managed by the user group based on the network plan and click OK. 5. Verify that the user group is created. Step 2. Configure remote authentication. 1. Log in to iMaster NCE Campus as a system administrator. Choose System. System Management. Authentication from the main menu. Choose Remote Authentication from the navigation pane and then click LDAP Authentication. On the display page, set basic information based on the data plan. 2. Configure server information. 3. Configure user attributes. 4. Configure user group attributes. 5. Configure mapping between users and user groups. Select Use Remotely Stored Bindings. Create and specify remote and local user groups. Six, click Test. Enter the username and password of the server administrator and click OK. Wait until a message indicates that the test is successful is displayed. Seven, click Apply. The system displays a message indicating that the operation is successful. Verifying the configuration. Step one. Log in to iMaster NCE Campus as an AD or LDAP user. 1. Access the iMaster NCE Campus service plane. Enter the system administrator's username and password and click Login. 
2. Check whether you've been granted with permissions specified by the user role and whether you can configure services for managed objects as expected. 3. Choose System, User Management, User Management from the main menu. Click the User tab and verify that the user status is normal and the login status is online.